Hi, my name is David Ridozi and I am uh, Autodesk Maya Certified Trainer. Um, I want to show you what I have had from release 1.6.1 1 .1 and 1.8.1 uh, of May 9. Um, yeah, but this is the, the last release. I want to go under the change logger and I want to show you immediately. First of all, I need to start my Maya. I already have installed uh, May 9, the last version. Uh, and in the channel, you can find uh, some information about install May 9 and install and so on and so far. So, uh, first of all, I want you to make a, a, um, a a journey back into time to show you everything I had in this release this is because I have, I have do not had so much more video from from 1.6.1 so um, first up, first thing I have had ID form what is ID form ID form is a, is a is a suite of the form uh, plugin that lets you make something like that I want to show you at the middle mouse button I want to create a sphere I want to create a duplicate of the sphere Create a little bit more tiny sphere. All right, great. So now I want to add to this object the deformation. So the left mouse button under deformers, I have my I collide. I can create my I collide. So in the inputs uh, stack, you can I show you the I collide. So I define what collide with these objects and select this other one object. And so now again, I can create another time my deformers I collide. And sorry, uh, add collider, add collider, add collider, add collider. So now simply works. So great. Another uh, uh, possibility you have is create ice skin deformer. Ice skin deformer lets you slide or uh, or uh, um, or push um, um, an, an object by using the position of another object. So for example, I can create. Uh, um, well, sorry, I want to create a little locator here. I can push this here, select the locator, select the object, the left mouse button. I want using the attract. So now this locator can attract this sphere. It's very, very powerful. So you can use the slide mode to, to slide the skin like a musk, a musk uh, is under under the skin. So very powerful way. Everything I want to very Ingo Clements create a lot of great plugin. And now I have had all this plugin inside of inside of my main line. I really want to thank him for his incredible work. Improve manipulation manipulator tool making menu. So very good. Um, from version 1.8.0, I have had the ability to have when you put, when you press uh, uh, W, for example, you have the, the move manipulator, the move gizmo. So now I can press Z, middle mouse button. I have an incredible marking menu about uh, totally dynamic. Uh, it's working in in dynamic symmetry, so you can set up the symmetry from here. Um, you can use a soft selection, enable or disable soft selection based on volume, based on or based on surfaces. Uh, uh, very powerful uh, in uh, update in real time. Uh, you can use the discrete move directly from here. So I think so. It's very very powerful. So it's, it's very similar to W uh, left mouse button, but in this case I want I, I create a Mercury menu more simple to use, more more um, more, more dense. I think uh, you can change the orient toggle based on the normal or the the, the objects. So very very powerful way to do that. And you can use the preserve UV, preserve silver the movement, or, or then uh, I think I think I think so. It's very powerful the reset things. You can reset every single every single setup for this tool. So you can starting from brand new uh, Maya configuration, uh, like the brand new Maya configuration. This is a very powerful way to change this kind of functionality right great um uh, any picker oh yes this is incredible julian julian Ber berlier i think so uh, sorry for for bad pronunciation if i um, do that so this is very powerful uh this is very powerful tool i want had a picker uh, ui picker for my um my do not have a ui picker so if I create a very fast rigging, I want to create such circle, I create a new one circle, control enter to freeze transformation and delete history, and now I can have uh, her, uh, yeah, uh, the sorry, that's L, her hand, 
and I have her hand. So uh, what, what I want to do from here, I want to take these elements and this element and add to the to um uh, sorry, add to um picker. So I need to use the middle mouse button. I go under animation, under animation. I want to using my uh, anim picker. So from here I have a picker. If I have already a rigging, but if I not already have a, a rigging, I need to create one. So I want to go under the middle mouse button, rigging editors and animation picker. Picker, yeah, this is the rig editor. As you can see, it is this cross. Let you um, tell that I am into into picker editor mode. So this is my L hand, L hand, sorry, L hand. My, my, my left hands. I need to create a new. I want to call character. Wow, great. Um, right mouse button. Uh, Add item, all right. Uh, options for this item, and I want to pick this element. So I had selection, had hand is here. I can change the color. I can change the number of points, the control points of, of this object. You can you can study it a little bit. It's very very simple to use. Uh, yeah, very good. Uh, now I can close this one. Yeah. Uh, I want to mirroring by taking out uh, automatically by using prefix these other elements. So I select my object, left mouse button, duplicate mirror, the L and R. So if I if a name start with L, can change automatically change with R. Very great. So now I need to go another time to Z middle mouse button animation. Sorry, animation and picker. Oh well, sorry, I did not, and I, I do not have saved that. Uh, it's very, it's, it's a real problem. I do it uh, again very fast. Uh, sorry for that. Remember, you need to, you need to save the. This is a save button, so there is no problem at all. So I can create again my elements. So I need to add item, add selection. Sorry, add oh, sorry. Add selection and now close this one. So I now need to duplicate mirroring. Okay, saving the data into the character node in this node. So I need to save and now Z with the mouse button animation and go under animation picker rig selector and I have my picker already working. Very powerful way to do that. So another time, add ability to token my windows, marking menu. So this is a um, ability to add and remove visibility toggle. Uh, if I press Z with, without, if I do not have anything selected in the view, press Z and the uh, left mouse button, I have this visibility toggle. I can toggle the curve. If I have, for example, some giants, I can. Uh, Oh, sorry. Uh, I can remove the visibility for the joints uh, and uh, and so on. So far, the yeah, polygons very very fast way to do that. Um, okay, I can to groups body. Yeah, I create for the uh, for any uh, for modeling uh, murky menu. I have that these icons with the vision and so on. So this is very let you make more simple to to view and select uh, the correct command from here. Uh, fix uh, some elements. Uh, um, see the yeah, I've had a little option uh, in the and double time change. Uh, this is a new feature about from uh, May 2016. Uh, SP uh, SP sorry <laughs> SP. Uh, three. Um, I have the update soap update. I have update red line. Uh, I see status line running thanks to Hango Clements. Another time is a this is um, a tool very 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 powerful. It's here. And you, if, if you see, if I select an object, it, it shows you here what I have select her hand, left hand, and so on. So on. from here I can rename. Powerful, very very powerful. This one, or I can um, change a prefix, uh, change the suffix, uh, make a replacement side of the selection. I think so. Very very powerful tool. So for I show what I have select and for changes is uh, is uh, is um, is a uh, name. All right. Um, 
uh, admin pull official mode. Okay, right. You have a show you press uh, W, press the in the mouse button. Other things I have had in this in this revision of Mercury menu, you can access the universal Mercury menu from here. So uh, if you don't have if you have a uh, um, uh, a manipulator enabled and you cannot show in you you don't see that because there is no selection as you can see i am always here or if i, I can press q for for quitting the tool or uh, from here i have my universal mercury you know, press q or something so far um um, some manipulation upgrade to eight. This is another little change about preferences. Uh, this way is is more simple. Okay, select the manipulator manipulator angle handle. Um, update soup. Uh, improve marking menu. Soup of now. All right. This is a service release. Uh, improve delete node local. See yes. I have create. I have improved my tool for delete uh, local node. A no node. You can find under the Z with the mouse button. Shin uh, Shin managers. From here you have delete. You know nodes or. Um, so if you can delete you know or look at not from here and I think so it's very very simple to do that all right all right or you can delete the lock and select a node from here so I am in the in the outliner Z left mouse button and edit oh, I have my delete my de sorry my delete node if it's locked all right Add a uh, uh, smooth skin class can wait tools. This is incredible. And another time from Ingo Clements, he have made a very incredible job for, for this tool. I think so. One of the best I see here. Uh, I can create an object, uh, for example, a sphere. Here, I go in my side view, I create some joints. So I select my joints, select my sphere, I can press Z, and by using the contextual key, I have my skin cluster applied. And now, if I'm moving, select my polygons, and go under the Z and the mouse button under the brush, I have the ability to uh, using uh, old order the, this classic paint skit way tool, but in this case, I need to select, press select the joints, or I can use. Uh, brushes smooth weight tool and in this case i can smooth the elements without selecting any joint by distribute uh, distribute automatically the weight of the elements on the on the joints um i think so very powerful uh add new hot key to eight to automatic start up ipr if i press eight is uh, load up the ipr render view um Um, all right, we I have uh, an upper end mode is enabled by default. If you're using uh, uh, extension release, the you 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 open the parallel mode in 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 over in um, in override, so you can uh, uh, parallelize the uh, nucleus uh, uh, calculation. Uh, improve modeling and animation workflow. Uh, remove aberrant weight uh, skin virtual skin weight. This because is uh, this, this, this is very similar to that, so I removed that for introducing the new tools. This is a C++, so it is most fast than, than before. This is a, a, a Python, Python script. Um, I am a cure combines very, very good, very incredible tool. Another time, the ability to combine two or more core cures. So if I create some circle, can duplicate uh, this circle here. I can select uh, every one of that and now I can combine. So I have only one object uh, like the polygon shell. So very, very interesting, I think. So um, very, very interesting way to do that. Um, yeah. Um, I'm just gonna combine the uh, new key at some more. Yeah, Alt G to toggle grid. So Alt G you can toggle the grid. Very fast way to do that. Uh, some update. Uh, Memory key update. Uh, new workflow. 
Um, oh, this is very interesting. The the crazed slider, uh, Stefan David, uh, do that. I want to really, really thanks uh, he and Martin Degan Anderson. So I want really thanks every everyone uh, uh, put their tools in uh, GPL on open source format, so I can redistribute that, or they give me the the, the license to redistribute their tools. So I really want thanks. Um, in this case, I have, uh, for example, a cube. Uh, if I press three and uh, take uh, this top edge, now I can press Z, left mouse button. I want to enter in crease tool. So the crease tool have the 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 contextual uh, alt uh, marking now press Z, middle mouse button. Now I can use uh, a value for crease, for example, ten or four or dot what five no crease using a crease editor or i want you can use this crease okay it's a crease slider this is a very very fast way to do so i can change dynamically the uh, the, the view of this element so i think so it's very very interesting way to do that and very powerful way to work um uh, the multicat uh, tool mark menu so there is a new mark menu under multicat tool if you load up the multicat tool and uh, right, uh, and now you're using a left mouse button and um, Z and left mouse button. You have uh, care mode, split mode, stack mode, less less pain. I love it. That this cat plane to cat the geometry I think it's very very powerful. Uh, great, and uh, we can go over. Um, the little change to shutter geometry script uh, it is, is because uh, there is some new about that um, very simple second object shutter geometry and the uh, geometry is shuttered out I change a little bit the, the way to do that uh, uh, update update uh, now redock the UI yeah, this is very interesting um, sometime uh, as I have had uh, for example in the Universal Mercury menu, I have added the ability to use, for example, an editor, so driving and key in docked way. So if you want to use in standard way without go under the, the Windows menu and, and so on so far, you can press Z, middle mouse button, rigging, editors, and use this uh, square button, and this undocked the, the Mercury menu. Uh, sorry, the, the, the menu, the window. Um, mm, 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 I change the script, the parent master, some update, uh, some uh, error on setup fixed. Uh, very thanks to Charlie Walls. Mirror fix and improvement, better contextual particle workflow. I have had a lot of things about um, customer menu or, or contextual marketing menu about particle workflow. Um, now you can dock the model rigging system. Uh, so you want to create an out rig uh, uh, by using main nine. I have had uh, creative rigs. Uh, Casual rig, sorry, uh, you can go under the rigging, and from here you can uh, have the builder docked. And uh, so from here in the in the left left area you can do that, or you can undock, of course, by using the same technique I showed you before. So so very very powerful. Um, very very good 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 some update uh, about about another uh, another element so um, I hope you like it I hope you find it useful and um, for a, a other video um, uh, you can you can look in the channel and um, I want to really thanks because in these days I have uh, I have reached 1000 uh, view so that's for sorry, one has a download on May 9, so I think so. Good, good result. So, bye.